our voices, born from the tales of trees and creatures, beyond thought and certainty, were deep within the turnings of a cave, from our ears into the tumble of our skulls, the iridescent sound travels, leaves light where we feel lost, finds new places for us to live, sets us in the swell and shiver of joy, the trouble below and above our briefest dream. <laughs> It's a 
uh, it was actually, I wrote this up at Bates Dance Festival. It's one of uh, a premier modern dance festival in the country up at Bates College in Maine. And I was actually in an improv class. This is about five or six years ago, because I love to go up there. And this is called The Small Dance. And when we improv or think about even contact improvisation, you've ever heard of that. A lot of times you really think about what's going on inside of you, and the movement inside of you, and the readiness before you feel like you want to move somewhere, okay? We call that the small dance, and so I just sort of wrote a poem about that, the small dance. Even when standing still, your stillness moves. So many worlds within you, just as wild as the universe outside. But imagine the lake at your core, Sea moss billowing, willow leaves stirring the water's surface. Dragonflies, their luminous meandering, lift you to feel the sky, allow the sky to pour through you while you stand attentive to the lucid edge. But uh, this is when I was living in North Carolina, too. It's called A Tall Tale for David Tyler Martin. Hey, baby, your great, aunt, your great aunt's long arms wave to you from North Carolina. Watch me lift, lift scissors to the clouds and cut a chain of weightless dolls all the way to Colorado to read around your cradle. I am large with family. Tall as Paul Bunyan, but more agile. I could somersault over the country without harming a tree and greet you smiling, landing soft as balloons on one knee. In a single swoop, my fingers could dip honey from the sun, leave drops that could sweeten you forever. Don't worry, dear grand nephew, we are timeless. You and I and all in between, and on each side, one arc, among a billion or more, of a family that stretches over all the earth, rocking like a lazy half moon, spilling our names everywhere. Uh -huh. 